I always thought the Red Cross was that organization that didn't take sides and just stood with prisoners of war and people from displaced persons camps, and they did everything they could to make sure that the downtrodden and displaced peoples have medicine and food. And it's all true, unless those people are hostages in Gaza from the October 7th massacre. And in that case, the Red Cross doesn't want to be bothered. Check this out. After the 30s and 40s, when the Red Cross was um, given the authority to visit prisoners uh, of war, uh, hostages that were taken after battle, even the Red Cross was admitted to Auschwitz. They didn't do a good job, obviously, but they got in. The Germans let them in. And the Red Cross visited uh, German POWs in Canada and the United States and elsewhere around the world. They're supposed to be a neutral organization to ensure the survival and the well-being of prisoners until they can be released uh, through negotiated settlements. Benjamin Netanyahu has been pushing the Red Cross hard and very um, accurately assigning them the responsibility to guarantee the health and survival of the hostages taken on October 7th by Hamas. In fact, Bibi personally delivered medicine for the elderly couples, uh, there's about a dozen of them that needed heart medicine, blood pressure, uh, diabetes medicine, and so on. The Red Cross refused to deliver the medicine and said, don't put any pressure on us. We are not going in to see those prisoners. Where is the outcry against the Red Cross for completely abrogating their responsibilities. They took credit for the release of the prisoners when they did nothing. It was negotiated by Qatar, Egypt, the United States, and Israel. They were delivered and driven in Red Cross vehicles, but that's all the Red Cross did. They didn't supply food, they didn't supply medicine, and they didn't supply um, well-being checks. And yet we're still supposed to consider the Red Cross as non-aligned and an arbitrary um, protector of the innocent and the hostages in wartime. I'm done with them. What is your thought? I, I have to agree. I mean, the performance uh, in this instance has been absolutely dismal. Uh, and and I'm not seeing much of a change either. Um, refusing to provide the medicine for these elderly hostages is is just complete, as you say, Barry, an abdication of their responsibility. Um, despicable. I I get very frustrated when I see the ads, donate to the Red Cross, we help people, we help mm. the prisoners. And, and it's a lie, Claire. It's absolutely a lie. They help the prisoners I mean, they want. Even if in other places, in, in other, let's say, disaster zones, uh, natural disasters or, or what have you, uh, even there, if they do admirable work, they abdicated their responsibility in this case. 100% correct. Correct. 